Okay, 20 seconds before the event. I have all the important buffs. I'm pretty sure I do. The luck bonus from the machine. Or not. Oh, my luck bonus from the machine expired. I need it back. It'll be slightly late. I need my luck bonus. Yes, I can show my current build. But after the fight, because I'm a little bit behind with time. Need to get back in there. After I get my luck bones. Real quick. They ran out. I cannot be sure. I'm pretty sure I only need one. So I will not be refreshing all of it. Just this one. That should give me 20. That should be good. I don't have time. That should be good. We'll be testing without VATS first. Then we switch for VATS testing. We'll try to observe results. I will be recording it as well. So I can then, after the stream, slow motion, watch it to see, to see the results. Okay, let's pop all of that. For this event you really need to have a chainsaw on you, especially if you plan to do it solo. Okay. Ultra side Titan, we still need to pop some. But I should use buffs at this point. Not the overdrive, just the psycho buff at this moment. I would like my adrenaline stuck, or should I do without adrenaline? Will he spawn something that I can stack adrenaline on? But only those explosive ones. Hmm, okay, I will not stack adrenaline on those. And I want to start with a Gatling Plasma. Or maybe now? Can I stack adrenaline on those if I run away? Okay, I have adrenaline. Okay, the stagger done. There is a timer, I forgot about the timer. So let's see. We are firing. I think the damage is good. My in the nerdwich. I didn't verify my build. It's about the bots. Is going a little bit slowly. Slower than I would like it. But I should be able to do 25% damage in a reasonable amount of time. We'll see. Come on. Pop it. Please pop it. I be doing in first person perspective maybe can i prevent stagger i'm not sure if i can prevent any staggers from happening the weapon will break you got that
Okay, definitely not the fastest without bats, but we did it. Okay. Don't know exactly how long it took. We double check. I have all the perks. I do have all the perks. Don't I? There is everything, yes. So now, let's see if Ultra Side Gatling Laser and no VATS does better. Or worse. Will it do better or worse? Oh, well, first down. Better or worse? Definitely there will be less reloads. Fire rate is much higher. It's a little bit lower damage per shot. I mean a little bit, about half. But fire rate is so much greater. You see, and accuracy is definitely better. It's way less spread, way easier to stay on the target. It's doing, I think maybe it's doing even better than Gatling Plasma. For the next portion, I will need to refresh my cycle button and stuff. Come on. But I'm only stacking adrenaline first and then I'm just firing. I'm not stacking adrenaline all the time. I did broke too, so one by one in fixing during combat. They both broke, so that's fair. <laughs> both broke during combat. How are we doing? Put me to the half health, please. Trying to hit the chest. There's so many reloads. We're running through those cores so fast. Running through those cores too fast. Regardless, I cannot avoid staggers no matter what I do. So it's just like Titan staggers seems to be impossible to avoid at all. Okay, maybe it's not doing better. Maybe it's doing about the same. Or worse. go 50 percent oh wow there's some crowd need to reload anyway so we run out the ammo from that some serious crowd Uh, usage of <laughs> buffs again. So I need to refresh buffs here. Maybe let's pop that first. Then like chainsaw something. And quickly use the overdrive psycho buff. Nika Cola Dark. Okay, here we go. Nika Cola Dark Psycho Buff. Now we're going for the Gatling Plasma. This time it will be in VATS. Let's stack some adrenaline for the starter and we need a lot of a lot of coffee so we pop like one bram the milk and then spam coffee spam the coffee probably enough target torso or chest there was chest target chest go in vats here we go in vats now Definitely more damage in VATS, there was enough coffee, and we got it, so huge difference in VATS for sure, <laughs> but that's not the point of this testing, we're not comparing VATS, no VATS, but you can tell now that it was smooth with VATS. There's a little bit too many more miners everywhere, we're reducing the crowd. Oh, the Gatling laser needs to be repaired beforehand. 
Okay, let's get ready. This time I will need to use like two cannons with running now. Gatling lasers, they would be even more coffee required. Let's stack some of the adrenaline. Okay. And okay. Two bottles of Brahmin milk. One, two, three. You need to calculate about 40 or something. Is it 40? More or less enough. I hope it's enough. Barely enough. Oh, not the stagger mid firing. I'm not sure which one did better. But there was a stagger meat firing. Unfortunate stagger meat firing. That was not planned. What are all the small miners doing here? Okay. Get rid of them. There's a lot of more miners. Area looting. Give me all the... Why area looting do not open? There's still someone alive. I like how they use energy weapons, so they were healing me. So tankiness part was not a problem. Got all the loot. I actually end up with more fusion cores than I started. Somehow I did loot at the fusion cores here. Think a little bit slower on ultra high Gatling laser. It is possible. I did pop all the buffs, so I did have all the buffs, including bubblehead for heavy guns, heavy gun crit damage, uh, there was mud fruit juice, day to juice, light soup, day to salad, there was overdrive and psycho buff running during the combat, there was lag buff to get crit every second shot from the Nuka Dark. The build. Oh, if you need screenshot, I can stop for longer now. I'm not worried about my buffs expiring. So that's the build used in here. About everything in it. Of all the damage. And I'm thinking if I should change anything with this build, but I feel really good about it at this moment. Maybe I should run it more. It's especially made for the core weapons. 